The really special thing is we were able to do this with my dad, Dominic's grandmother, and that, <laughs> Dominic's grandmother. Dominic's grandmother? My dad is Dominic. So a lot of you guys have already seen the Super Strat teaser that I put up in a few other places, but if you didn't, no worries. This is the full how-to video from start to finish. Taking a pretty basic Fender Squire and turning it into the Fender Dominator, which is a beast of a guitar. My son Dominic is starting to get into making music on piano, on the launch pad, on guitar, electronically, and we only recently moved back to the United States. So for many years, this was the kind of project that would have been really hard to do. But now that we're back in DC, not only were we able to find all the parts and things we needed pretty easily, but the really special thing is we were able to do this with my dad, Dominic's grandfather, and that really meant a lot to us. Anyway, I put all the links to the parts and the accessories that you need to do something like this down below. Of course, I'll leave the comments open. So let me know if you have any questions, suggestions down below. And you'll notice in the video, there is the idea that we take on another similar project this summer. So of course, do all the liking and subscribing down below. And you'll know when more videos like this go up on YouTube. Okay, enough for me. Let's go. Hi, my name is Dominic. I am nine years old in the third grade. I live in Arlington, Virginia, and my birthday is October 5th. <laughs> you, are you sure? You remember your birthday? Yeah. Well, what are you holding there? What do you got there? My what, guitar. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. My guitar. That's your guitar? Mm hmm What do you call it? Fender Dominator? The Fender Dominator? Mm-hmm. Well, where did you get the Dominator? I made it. Where did you first get it? On Christmas. At Christmas. Tell me about it. What did it look like when you opened up? It was black, white, and same size. It said something Fender here. These were white. Whammy bar was white. This was white. These also were white. It was a lot of white. Now, as you can see, it's a lot of black. So here we're looking at my guitar, how it was wrapped at Christmas. Here I am holding the, the guitar the very first time. And then what did we immediately start doing here? We took off the bridge. And then this is what it looks like with everything taken off. Okay. And then so we blow torched it. Wait, what now? We blow torched it. Why did we blow, what, what, what were we doing with the blow torch? We were taking all the finish off. Because we didn't we didn't have like a proper heat gun, right? So No, so we, we used just, a blowtorch. We just set the thing on fire. That was cool, that was fun. Mm hmm And then after we burned it up, took all the finish off. It was black. I sanded off the letters on the headstock. And then here I am power sanding it. That's when it's all sanded down, right? Yeah. And blowtorched. Yeah. Alright, then the next step was to take primer. The primer keeps all the new paint from soaking into the wood. Yep. We put the base layer on, which is obviously red. And that looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. We could have left it just like that. And then what was going on here at Home Depot? We went to get a bucket. What's that big bucket for? That big trash we can? put water in it and that's how we hydro dip it. And then we hydro dipped it. Okay, now, hydro dipping. We have a video of that, but I want you to explain to me what, what you mean by hydro dipping. So you put spray paint or whatever you're using uh -huh. on top of the water, and then you you pour whatever you're painting into the water and then quickly take it off. hydro dipping it and my dad said no it's not enough no it's not enough no it's not enough and then it froze and and barely any of it got off
<laughs> Way to go, dog. There's a Did lot it, of but, feet okay, on now, it, though. Now, remember your training. Hold it and hold it out. But, okay, wait, wait, wait. Don't go too far. be careful. We should have done this in summer. Well, let's do it again yeah. in the summer. Yep. We cleaner coated it multiple times. How many times did we clear coat it? Like a thousand times. And then we just had to wet sand and clear coat. And wet sand and, and clear coat. And, and wet, wet sand, sand and clear coat. coat. And, and wet sand and clear coat. And, and wet then we sand also had to cut a little notch out, right? Do you remember mm -hmm. that? Why did we have to do that? Because that fretboard wouldn't fit. The, the pick guard. Pick guard, fretboard, yeah. same thing. It's not the same thing. What's the pick guard then? The pick guard is the thing the pickups are attached to. That's the fretboard. The fretboard is what you use on your with your oh, left sorry. hand. Oh, sorry. Sorry about that. That's <laughs> okay. Putting words on the headstock. And the words are, of course. Fender Dominator. Yeah, that was called a water slide decal. Okay, and there mm -hmm. it is on the, on the headstock. That's the fretboard. Yeah, that's the fretboard. Here I was polishing with lemon oil. And then we started, what? We started putting the whole thing back together again, right? Was any of it actually any fun? Well, actually, maybe when we put it all back together. So when I got home, the, yep. I soldered the new pickups into the, mm -hmm. to the switch and the ground. Have you ever done any kind of art projects or projects like this before with Daddy? Actually, multiple times. When I was in Mozambique, um, a lot of what I had to do was videos, and my dad helped me a lot with that. You mean me? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I like spending time with you, and it's really, really fun. Not tonight. Which would you rather do tonight? Would you rather play some? Would you rather rock out on the Fender Dominator, or would you rather play Madden with Daddy? Madden with Daddy. What? You have this brand new electric guitar, and you want to play Madden with Daddy? I love you too. We're also cutting this part. Why are we gonna cut this part? Okay. Because it's annoying. I promise. The part where I say I love you, I'll cut it out. I love you. No. No, don't. play it but like I thought you meant like putting more stuff on it I was like no we're not no <laughs>